Acrobat 11 introduces a new feature that allows you to reply to a comment in a more convenient and logical way than in previous versions. The replies are now nested within the original comment. Let me show you what I mean. I'm beginning this video with the letter reply file already open on my computer. And I'm going to go ahead and go to the comment section. And you can see that we have several comments, a total of four, in the comments list. And we can see that these were made by John Doe and we can see when they were actually made as well. Now the cool thing about being able to reply to these is that they're now nested within the original comment. So for example, I'm going to click on this first comment and I can see that John is indicating that we change this person's title to Miss instead of Mrs. And I don't think that's correct. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to right click on the comment and I'm going to choose Reply. And you can see that now in Acrobat 11, instead of creating a totally separate comment, it's now nested right here in the pop-up, which is really convenient. And within that comment, I'm going to go ahead and type a comment here. I'm going to type uh, Joe. I'm not sure if this is correct. Now, another thing I want to point out here is that new in Acrobat 11 is the fact that these comments are actually spell checked as you type. And we can see that I misspelled that word. It's very obvious, so I'm just going to fix that. And now I'll just click within that note to complete that comment. Now in addition, as you're reviewing these comments, you also have a status button here. So if uh, Joe gets this back and he decides, you know what, I, I do know it's correct, he can just click the checkbox here to indicate to himself that they are in fact correct and he's basically set the status to checked and it's done. And he can click this minus button to then collapse that note as well. Again, up here in the find button within the comments pane, you can also filter. So if you type in uh, a note here such as MS, you can see that it's filtering the list of comments to show the ones that relate to, to that content. I'm going to go ahead and delete that to remove the filter. And so once I've replied to all of these comments, I can send this back to Joe and we can keep going back and forth as often as necessary. As you can see, it's quite easy to reply to comments in Acrobat 11. It's a great way to collaborate with other users to guarantee that corrections and changes are made accurately.